Hello guys, welcome to the first video in Android Kotlin tutorial series. In Google I.O. 2017, Google introduced a new programming language for Android application development called Kotlin. Uh, Kotlin is developed by JetBrain, the same company who create Android Studio for Google. Kotlin is a very easy to use language. Uh, Kotlin and Java are compatible with each other that means you can call Java code segments from Kotlin and also you can call uh, Kotlin code segments from Java that means uh, you can use your existing Android Java project with Kotlin so from Android studio version 3.0 onwards Kotlin will be integrated with Android studio that means if you are using Android studio 3.0 or above uh, there is no need to install any plugin to use Kotlin but if you are using Android Studio version lower than 3.0 you have to attach Kotlin as a plugin so on this first video I'm going to show you uh, how to install Kotlin plugin in Android Studio version lower than 3.0 and how to install Android Studio 3.0 so on the day of creation of this video Android Studio 3.0 available in Kenry channel and there is no stable version of Android Studio 3.0 is available so first here I'm going to show you how to install Kotlin plugin in Android Studio version lower than 3.0 So here my Android Studio version is 2.3.3 So in order to using Kotlin with this Android Studio I have to install the Kotlin plugin So click the file menu and select settings and go to plugins and click this button install JetBrain plugins uh, From here uh, you can search Kotlin here it is Kotlin language uh, it is about 59.2 MB of size and click install uh, now here the Kotlin plugin installation finishes now I need to restart Android studio so restart Android studio now Okay, now here the Kotlin plugin installation finishes. You can check it, go to tools, and here is the Kotlin plugin. So this is how we integrate, this is how we uh, install Kotlin plugin on Android Studio version lower than 3.0. Now I will show you how to install uh, Android Studio version 3.0. Uh, on the date of creation of this video uh, there is no stable version of android studio version 3.0 is available and uh, now only the preview version is available so now uh, we are going to download and install the android studio 3.0 preview version android studio 3.0 download So now the Android version 3.0 available in Canary channel. So now I am going to download it. So download it. It's about 700 MB of size. So now here the download started. Okay now here the download of Android Studio 3.0 is finished. Now go to the download folder. So here is the file. Uh, it's a zip file so the first thing you have to extract it now I'm going to extract it into a folder uh, 
okay here the extraction is finishes so these are the files for android version 3 android studio version 3.0 so you can use a preview preview version of android studio side by side with a stable version so in this computer i already install a stable version of android studio so now i copy this uh, preview version now go to the windows directory of this computer uh, go to program files open android and here is the stable version of android studio so if you are using android studio version 2.3.3 uh, or lower uh, the version name is not available in folder name so you have to rename this stable version folder otherwise the android studio version 3.0 files override it so now i'm going to rename it android studio 2.3.3 now I'm going to paste the Android Studio 3.0 files here. Okay, now here we have a stable version and a preview version available in this folder. Now I'm going to open this preview version. For that, just go open the bin folder. And here is the application icon. So if you using a 64 bit version of Windows, you have to open this one. And if you using 32 bit, you can simply uh, open this file, this uh, icon, studio icon. So here I am working with a 64 bit operating system. So I have to open this one. So I open it. And do not import any settings or, or if you want to uh, retain your previous settings you can use that one and click ok so now we successfully install android studio 3.0 preview version so now we'll try to start a new android studio project so i already told you that the Kotlin support is integrated with Android version 3.0 and above. So when you create a new project in Android Studio 3.0, uh, you can include Kotlin support at the time of creation of the project. So now we successfully uh, prepare this computer for Android Kotlin development. I hope you understand all these concepts. To get more Android Kotlin tutorial updates, please subscribe this channel now. Thank you for watching. See you in the next episode.